Right, welcome back, friends and scoundrels and people and stuff. Um, we're going to try this random thing here. I know people like to watch people open stuff, and that's where we started the channel. So uh, I just got my order this week from Reaper Minis at reapermini.com. Um, little quick thing, though. I just got an email from them. I ordered this last Wednesday, and one of my favorite things about Reaper is that they're usually right on top of everything. And I got my confirm my order confirmation, and the next day, practically first thing in the morning, I expected my package to be put together and shipped to me, and to get that email. And I gave it a couple days. Maybe there was some kind of bug or something. Uh, benefit of the doubt, all that good stuff. But I emailed them this morning. They just got back to me a couple, a little while ago. I don't know exactly when, but I just looked at it. Um, letting me know that there was a glitch in their system and that they uh, gave me my tracking number. Opened it up, look at the tracking number, and they, uh, sorry, I'm going to start opening this. So that way it's not as boring. Um, and it is out for delivery. So, lo and behold, almost as soon as I put my tablet down from checking into it and responding to them, telling how great they are, um, it was dropped off in my mailbox. So, without much more ado, we got things. I made a mess. Nice. So... See what all we got here. I mean, I know what I got, but you don't know what I got. So I got two of these desert things here. And they're going to go with these hoardlings. Because I need some gazers for my game. Honestly, this weekend, if we'd have been able to, I would have ordered them sooner. But I'm going to take these guys. Oh, get on frame. These guys here that don't have wings. And I'm going to modify them with the tentacle bits here it seemed to be the cheapest way for me to get those um, to make my gazers because they're about the right size or at least I'm going to say they are then I picked up a ward because I just wanted one and I got these goblin wolf things to kind of go with them I'll maybe take a better look here in a sec Um, to go with them, I'm going to try to build an encounter around it. And then I got this Zello, uh, Zellorian Tyrant Darkspawn thing. He's a type of beholder, really. Uh, I'll see if I can get him put together. And then this month they have, or this year, they're doing, they've got a new... Uh, line that they're releasing bones black, which is supposed to be a sturdier material and This is the first one I've got so I can't speak too much to it, but This rock troll was the first Or was the February free mini when you ordered $40 or more that was part of the reason for the warg and the other guys as I was really close to that so Go ahead and just do it so I'll pull this apart and take a better look at a couple of these things. So here we are, got our warg out of the box. It's one of the things with the reaper bones is until they're painted or something, or at least primed gray, they're hard to see. Um, these are the goblin wolves. I thought they were different sculpts or poses or something, but... Apparently not. I'll have to look into it. I'm not going to make a big deal though because I'm going to paint them. But I just, these guys are pretty cool. And these ones are pewter. That's all that they're available for. But just, these guys looked really creepy and I thought they'd be a good match. Um, then we've got our Beholder Light guy. I actually got him because I need a spectator. And he's not all put together, I just kind of threw the big part together. 
Um, but I need a spectator, and he only has four eye stocks. Let's see if I can get them. Uh, one of them fell off, and I seem to have misplaced it already. So, go me. But you can see. Oh, there it is. There's the other one that's come off already. And here we got some horns. It's got these other tentacle things. I'm not going to put those on. I'll save them for something else. Here's his mouth. But as you can see, there's a lot to put together on this guy. And I'm not sure which way I want to do it all. So, But I'm going to have to do that either here in a minute or later on. Um, and we got the rock troll. Probably already saw it because it's clearing. But this is something I've noticed with this one um, on the Reaper site and other people that have gotten this is the gaps here where they've put it together and that's kind of always been my only issue with Reaper the things that come multi-part I would like to see um, come apart instead of glued together so that way I can clean it up and make it fit the way that I need to. But he's also, and this is the other thing I've seen with this one, he doesn't fit his base right. And I don't know if maybe there's just some shrinkage or what. But I wasn't even sure if I was going to use the base. Because I'll just put him on a, another base. But this guy's pretty gnarly. I like him. I'll have to make something up to use him for. Um, the desert thing and the kobolds I saved for last because I just show you some of my painted ones. Because I already have a few of these. The desert thing I just thought was cool. Star like pit or whatever. And I used it for a mini con game. And then here's my hordlings. So you can see he's got like three eyes. I can carve that, carve those out and make it a single one figure out what to do here. I might leave his arms on and try to fit some eyeballs in or something. And see, this guy's already only got one eye, but they're already kind of gazer shaped and about the right size, so I figured they would work. And then the little Cthulhu guy, he's pretty neat. So, that's what we got. Uh, stay tuned in the future to see how some of these guys look a little bit better when they're painted up. And I'll definitely do a follow-up with the gazers to see how they turned out. So this is going to be a pretty interesting mod for me. Um, yeah, till next time, live to roll. Thanks for watching. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, and all the good stuff. Tell me which one of these you're most interested in seeing down below. And... I already said it, but live to roll.